Braulio Perez of NJ.com and the Star Ledger. I'm here with Frank Darby of Lincoln High School. Frank, you're headed to Arizona State to play your college football. You know, just, I know it's been an up and down process for you. You were headed to Iowa, things didn't work out there. You opened things up, committed to Arizona State this morning. Who did you speak with and let them know that you're gonna be a Sun Devil? I spoke with my um, recruiter, Jay Novell. Um, I had to let him know that I really wanted to play for him and wanted him to coach me up to become one of the great players that ever came out of New Jersey. He had coached very great players in the NFL, like Marlon Williams, um, Reggie Wayne, all of them, the Texas Cats, and coach. He's a great person, and I just like community with, um, basically united with him, and felt that he it was a great place to be with him. Like when we spoke this morning, you said that you two had a had a great relationship. Did that pay uh, play kind of a big role in your decision? Yes, actually, um, we was bond we bonded together. We bonded from I don't know how and but I just felt like he was the right person to be um to be coached by. Um, he's not the type of person to brag about what he done and what he accomplished. But if you look at his resume, you can see everything that he was like a great coach and he could get me to the next level and help me do all everything. Um, and also, um, I really respect the fact that he came almost three three thousand miles all the way to New Jersey just to a public school just to come see me and mm -hmm. went back home. That just showed like just so much respect that he was very interested in me and um, really wanted to coach me. That's why, that's why I had to say that I will play for you because I really like appreciate what you've done and what you've been doing with me. And how difficult was it for you to turn down some of the other schools? I know you had a, a high interest from Rutgers, Boston College, Virginia Tech, and others. How hard was it to turn those other schools down? It, been, it was so hard, so hard actually. Um, my hardest one turned turn down with Boston College. Um, me and my recruiter, Carpinelli, like, we, like, we had a strong bond. Ever since when he was at Rutgers, he was recruiting me, trying to get me there, but they, I guess they wasn't like off, um, actually like trying to recruit me, but he was like, he was like, we had a strong bond. And we went to Boston College, and now I'm recruiting back up. He came strong, he came harder than anyone else, how, how bad he wanted me to be there. Um, yeah. Then Rutgers, I mean, understand, like, I like what's going on there. The coaching staff is great, but as I really see that, he's going to win a lot of games, he's going to change that place around and turn to, I don't know, a, way to, a, a better place than what it has been. Um, the players, Coach Williams there, um, I just like, I was like, I felt like them coaching staff there is great. They, they gonna, they gonna win a lot of games there. Um, Virginia Tech wasn't into, wasn't really into me, not yet, until they came today, came by today, but I was already been to my visits and felt where I needed to be, where my heart told me to go to. So that was just, that was just everything. That was just what I had to say. I got you, Frank. And last thing I got for you, you got a message for the Arizona State fans. I know your phone's been blowing up on Twitter with how excited people are. You got a message for the Sun Devil fans out there? Uh, yeah. Folks up. We, we, we about to go win this national championship. All right, great. Thank you, Frank. All right.